It's almost like when I was born, I, I, I just had a myriad of, like, of, of guitar players. I won't forget one of the guitarists actually that uh, one influencer a lot. Uh, one influencer, not knowing that's what he was doing. But U Doctor was a left handed guitarist and Bene Pendi Kabasa, Begu Pendi Bizanga Kabasa. So he was like the man, best pegay and with a Yabonda, we are not so traveling. Why is why to unspec? Yabon, it's open because we too, if we end up, I uh, who number one, Yabon. We met Doc when we went to Durban. The Beatles went to Durban, you know, during the rock period. I think he played for a band called the Naked Truth. And uh, we we always wanted to get uh, different players in our band. Doc was uh, was the immediate person that I invited to come and join the band after Louis Mla. That was uh, in 1978. So, uh, and Bay left-handed guitarist. So, and he was the kind of person Oben challenger, you know, and because. That famous song. Then we read one thing as Spain. And at the time, I, 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 I we don't have a differentiation with each other. No, we don't have. Silale guitar. The Jimi Hendrix of South African rock. And I think a lot of us, uh, many guitarists, would have wanted to play guitar like Jimi Hendrix. And certainly, Doc was one of those people who felt. They could be a Jimi Hendrix because he was also a left-handed player. Immediately after recording that album, they left him and Opus Ahoy left to form a band called Kabasa. Yeah, he was fine talking. He was an amazing guitarist. He played with Bruce Mshomo. 